Around 10.45 a.m. Police Operations Control received a phone call informing that there had been a serious road traffic accident here along Pilgrim Road in Christchurch. Uh, we immediately mobilized our personnel. Uh, personnel from District B Police Station and Oystins Police Station responded. Uh, we got here within about 12 minutes of the report and we were able to confirm that there were in fact two, two vehicles involved, a uh, pickup van owned by the Ministry of Health and uh, a tour bus, um, privately owned and ran, ran with the TAP program, the Transport Board program. Um, on our arrival, we recognized there at least 11 persons complained of injuries. Those injuries have been assessed by um, ambulance personnel who arrived at the scene. I must say there were five ambulances who came here early and were able to assist us uh, as well as, as two medical doctors at the scene. Um, those injuries were described as not serious. Of the 11 persons who were injured, three persons were transported to the Queen Elizabeth Hospital, one person to the Randall Phillips Polyclinic and seven of those persons were discharged seeking private medical attention. Now, more importantly and sadly, we had the driver of the pickup vehicle. He unfortunately died at the scene. He was pronounced dead at the scene. Um, our condolences, of course, goes out to his immediate family. They have not yet been notified. We're in the process of, of doing that. And of course, to the minister and his ministry and all those associated with, with him. We are yet to confirm the identity of the individual and as soon as we do that, we will let you and the public know what is happening. Um, there were two fire tenders who also assisted with this rescue and as you can see, we are still very much um, involved. And that's the update I can give you at this stage. Any other questions you may have, I may be able to answer a little later on.